So, at uh, Asura's Wrath? Asura's Wrath? It's called Asura's Wrath. Okay. And well, it's Japanese. A Capcom, Capcom game. It's got a guy with six arms who seems a lot like the Japanese Kratos. I'm putting this one in the running for Crazy Japanese Game of the Year. Oh, shit. Here so we let's, go. So, let's take a look. Asura's Wrath! Asura is wrathful. Why are you saying that like you're on Dragon Ball Z? I'm so angry right now. It's the wrath. The wrath, the wrath. is just, it's built up within me. Okay. Hopefully this will make some sort of sense. Episodes, options, trophies. Yeah. Let's go. Normal. <laughs> well, yeah, well, yes, Asura's Wrath. I'm, I'm sure. Are you sure? <laughs> I don't know, maybe it's really hard. <laughs> like Japanese hard. There's hard, then there's Japanese hard. Motherfucker, I beat Dark Souls, all right? <laughs> I don't... I, it, you came out changed. I beat Devil May Cry 3 on normal difficulty level. Oh, good for you. Well, normal difficulty level in the U.S. was hard in Japan. That's why I said that. Oh, really? Uh-huh. Project Barracuda. That's, I think... Is that Mount Fuji? I don't know, man. Okay. When you just assume that since it's Japanese, that the, any mountain you see is Mount Fuji? Well, you know what kind of horrible racist I am, so. Mm -hmm. It's a civilization, demigods, weapons. Legions. Yeah. Elite demigods. Eight guardian generals. General Ashura. Okay. That's, All right. Okay. Thick of battle. So. Blah, blah, blah. Capcom. The world. Smokey. Yeah, this guy. This guy standing on the moon. <laughs> of course. I like it. I like it. <laughs> He's got spaceships. That's right. What the fuck is happening? He's a god. It's, these are the weapons they made to beat the Gora. Or... He's not on the moon. He's standing on the front <laughs> of a Star Destroyer. Wait, we already did this. A sure... <laughs> did, okay. we, we did, right? Oh, no, I'm... I don't know. Okay. And he just... He's jumping into orbit. He's a demigod. You know. Okay. No, well, that's cool. Got, oh, okay. Uh, space Harrier. <laughs> yes. All right. So wait, were these... Um... I don't know what's going on. You're shooting stuff what, and falling. What are these things, though, that I'm shooting? These giant... Uh... The little asteroid things? Or fish? Why doesn't he just do this from standing on top of the ship? Why yeah. does he have to be jumping down here? Oh, the, nope, they're they are totally fish. fish. <laughs> Good call, Mr. Murphy. I don't speak Japanese, but I'm very fluent and crazy. <laughs> oh, no! Rapid fire. Okay. Shoot the squid thing? I think so. Shoot it a lot? I, I'm trying. <laughs> yes! Now, this is what I'm talking about. L2 and R2? Yep. Quick time events, no idea what's going on. Go Goma home. Lasher! It's got an impurity level of 13,000, Jason. Well, of course it does. <laughs> what did you think you were going to get from Goma Lasher? <laughs> well, most Goma Lashers only have an impurity level of like 5,000. This so. guy's made out of like, like stuff like the thing. He's got like gold. peach color. Oh no! 240,000? That is a high number? <laughs> I, I really, I mean, you know, I, I'm gonna, st I'm gonna say I don't understand what's going on here one more time, and then I'm gonna stop because otherwise that's all we're gonna, that's all this is gonna be. Okay, yeah, that's true. <laughs> yeah. All right. Um, I'm hoping it'll make some sense, you know. Okay. Lock on fires. Okay, we got rapid fires, lock ons. I feel like I'm playing Res, a really angry version <laughs> of Res. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I think he said he had six arms. He he will eventually. Okay, and turn in the thing. Totally arbitrary quick time events. Mm -hmm. I don't know. What do you think? Are you glad to see that completely arbitrary quick time events have kind of fallen out of style? Or yes. Oh. On a giant face. Space face. The Karma Fortress. The Laser Man in space. What the hell? <laughs> A long struggle. You know, this... I, I, okay, now I know. I know what this reminds me of. Final Fantasy? No, an episode of Gundam. <laughs> <laughs> That's worse. <laughs> this guy's on his, his, his silver surfer, the golden surfer. This shit's just flying everywhere. Yeah, this is totally Gundam. 
just gonna write this down. Don't watch. <laughs> Bunch of rock dicks flying in the air. Okay, well. People worshiping she a, yoga. Is that like a McDonald's cup on her head? What's going on there? Aw. The impure have defiled. Okay. So, are we the good guys or the bad guys? <laughs> Does it matter? And there's. Who's this guy? Shiny face Pope. He's the 128th Emperor, of course. Strata. Mm -hmm. <laughs> this opera shit's gotta stop, too. <laughs> Princess Mithra. Right. So they're borrowing from Sumerian mythology, as okay. they often do. So I think that the um, like the info dump at the beginning of um, Kingdoms of Amalur is looking like wussier and wussier by the second. Oh, man. <laughs> Okay. The info dump in Kimas of Onwar reads like IKEA instructions compared to this. <laughs> okay. All right. When are we gonna get down there? That's what I want to know. I heard a space harrier. I don't know if I have to hold down the the triangle button or what. It's helping me out. I don't know if I'm destroying this. <laughs> Again, are we the good guys or the bad guys? Uh, oh, oh, I missed that one. Uh, you fucked that one up. Damn it. I deigned to scratch my nose for a moment. <laughs> what a fool. No, it's like, um, it's like, uh, uh, um, what's the thing? What was the game last year? What was the crazy Japanese game last year that we played? Uh, El Shaddai oh, meets right. Star Wars. Okay, <laughs> yeah. Some Robotech thrown in for good measure. That guy's awesome. What did he do? Did he just blow up that thing by punching it? Yes. Well, look at his mustache, though. Look at his giant arm. He's got like a... What is that beard made of? <laughs> it doesn't move like any natural element. It is the beard of a god! Is that you? No, did, no. That's did you not... just get crazy hair? <laughs> Maybe. Dragon Ball Z hair? Did you just get pissed off so you got Goku hair? <laughs> How many more anime references can we fit into this one 30-minute video? Well, I ran out of synonyms for weird about <laughs> five minutes ago. August. August. All right. Not. And then is this the emo Asura. one? Asura. They're showing us the eight generals. The, all the eight. Yeah. Yeah. I don't give a fuck, really. <laughs> this is like the beginning of that goddamn Final Fantasy game you made me play. No. Yes. Well, okay. Yes. But at least that was like, okay, it's Valhalla. They're in a place with a castle. This is in space. There was a roller coaster. <laughs> these are these are dudes jump kicking guys in space. Yeah. And this. <laughs> and then we cut back to this. Oh, oh. I'm punching my way out. Yeah. No! <laughs> oh, he's so wrathful. Oh, man. <laughs> so angry. He just punched his way out of the belly of that giant fish. I have a hard time knowing what I'm... I can't... Like, if I was just sitting here not touching the controller, would it make any difference to what's going on on the screen? Is this all cosmetic? It reminds me of the end of, uh, of Bayonetta. Except this is the very beginning of the game. Did you play Bayonetta? No. That game was awesome. That was with the naked chick, right? Yeah, her uh, clothes were made out of hair, and you could, uh, whenever you cast, like, a spell, yes! uh, all her clothes would come off, and her hair would turn into, like, a giant dragon and eat people. Ooh! <laughs> I obviously have not had enough scotch or cold medicine. <laughs> To I'm understand you, what you're saying, I'm, what you're doing. I'm telling you. I'm going to make you review the Devil May Cry HD collection that comes out. By the time you get done with that, it should make perfect sense. I'm going to give you a Drano enema. That's what I'm going to do. <laughs> oh, man. Who is this guy? No. Is that a guy? Sergey. Of course his name's Sergey. He's all <laughs> over dramatic. He's a theater kid. <laughs> <laughs> what is he? This guy's upside down. Why is that guy rolling around? I can't tell if this is really advanced technology or magic or what. Are these people? Alright, that's pretty normal. So we're about 10 minutes in so far. That's all? 
Oh, shit. Man, this is... Wow, this is Japanese. Yeah. This is so Japanese. And I don't give a good goddamn what's happening. <laughs> okay, so these are eight god... Demigod yeah. generals leading the super weapons of heaven against the invaders. The fish. Yes. The, wait, the... The Brahmastra. <laughs> I said Brahmasutra for a second there. <laughs> oh, no, dude, no. <laughs> yeah, I'm kind of just... I'm, I'm, I'm starting to get a little bit numb, though. I'm going to go into a little bit of, uh, of crazy shock. Yeah. Maybe that's what they're counting on. Yeah, maybe so. I do want an iron beard like that guy has. I mean, it's just like a bayonet. Not that guy. He's got an iron hipster beard. I do like the art style, though. They're kind of like a uh, cross-hatched kind of thing. That actually reminds me of El Shaddai, now that I think about it. Oh. So the laser Meanwhile, man. at Burning Man in space... The Burning Man is the Brahma Sutra. Wait. Oh no! <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> Get out of the way! It's like the big face space Death Star laser. So wait, they weren't actually shooting at the fish, they were just gonna blow the earth up? Okay. There was some discussion about the wiseness <laughs> of this choice. Yes. Everybody disagrees. Okay. Behold, it is Vlitra, says the fat guy, floating in space. They can hear each other's voices for some reason. Oh. And, and the earth just popped a big boner. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I don't know if that was part of the plan. <laughs> Goma Vlitra. Impurity level is your bowl. Yeah. Yeah, this... this... I don't think this is what they had in mind. So wait, the, did the Earth just sprout a big mouth and start yelling at them? Is that what just happened there? And fucking everything up. Oh, man. Brahma Sutra is never a good idea. Well, see, that's what happens <laughs> when giant space face shoots at the Earth when it's getting attacked by giant fish. These are words that I just said. <laughs> All right, let's see what this game is actually like. Yeah, I, I really do feel like I'm watching an episode of some really crazy TV show. I feel like I just chewed on, like, a, a couple of Ambien and stayed <laughs> awake and s stared at some random anime. It's like, what, Jason, you've never done DMT before? Come on, this shit's par for the course. <laughs> no, sorry. <laughs> what, are they going to go fight the Earth Mouth now? I think so. That's what it looks like. I can't really tell what's even going on, like where these guys are in relationship to the giant space head or the giant earth mouth or... or what they're doing to the space fish. Right. Now Asura is jumping at something. And we're back to this. Okay, guys, we need to get off of, we need to get away from this. This yeah. is starting to lose its luster. So uh, Capcom, fuck you. <laughs> Come on. No, I have to play this. Oh, yeah, you do, don't you? <laughs> oh, I think you fucked that one up. Maybe. No, this guy's gonna come, uh, I'm just gonna punch my way out of him like I did before. This is the most dramatic kung fu I've ever seen in my entire life. <laughs> Space kung fu. <laughs> We're fighting against the vagina of the earth. <laughs> These guys gonna. Are these guys going to cut punch the Earth? <laughs> They're going to cunt punch Mother Earth. So it looks like Mother Earth is on the rag. <laughs> or has herpes. What if those? <laughs> oh, all right. It's hard for me to even tell if what I'm doing has any real bearing on what the fuck is going on on the screen right now. It probably doesn't. 
so has there, I mean, you know, we talked about this, or we maybe talked a little bit about it during Final Fantasy, but uh, has there ever been like a, a really kind of like Japanese developed game that you've been a big fan of? Because so far it kind of seems, uh, you know. Uh, I'm trying to think of uh, one. There probably was at some point. Like Devil May Cry? You um, played the original Devil May Cry? I never really liked Devil May Cry. I played it. Um, never really liked Metal Gear. I'm sorry. Don't hit me. Um, <laughs> I made my peace with the fact that everybody can't like Metal Gear. <laughs> the Final Fantasy games. I liked Golden Sun a lot. Okay. Uh, Chrono Trigger. Okay. And uh, Fire Emblem, which is... No, that might be American. I don't know. Mm, oh... Hey, see? I told oh, you. Oh, there it is. <laughs> More arms. Yes. That was... <laughs> what? And... I have so many arms! <laughs> He's a six-armed vagina, Asura. That's not what it said, but I like that. <laughs> He's serious. <laughs> you know how he serious? You know how I know? He's got six arms. Yeah. And Mother Earth's vagina is like, bring your six arms, I can take them all. Yeah, here come the lasers. What are you gonna do, punch all the lasers? It looks that way. Yeah. This, this is Robotech all up and down. Let's see. I'm kind of curious to know what happens if you, uh, okay, we're getting closer here. Boom, boom, boom. Uh, air dash, okay. Yes. Am I winning? Jason, you can see the rest of the screen. I can only look at the middle. Am I winning? No. <laughs> Are there things shooting out of me and hitting the giant Earth vagina? Uh, yes. Okay. Good. Great. Not great, but good. I didn't know what it needed. I didn't know what it wanted me to do. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> um, yay? I'm excited, I guess. I, Jeff, you take yeah. this. I don't know, man. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, this is this is like, I, I hate to keep relying on anime, but th this kind of also reminds me of um, this anime called Die Buster that's all kind of like giant space opera. Things are blowing up. Like, people are all super... You know, I'm using the power of fury to get shit done. And it's like, well, awesome. You can do that in Japan, in America. It's like, oh, I've got six <laughs> arms. That's supposed to mean something. Yeah. Like, have you ever played Ace Combat? Yeah. Where, like, you know, the conversations characters have in Ace Combat are all about, they aren't about, like, the morality of murdering people. It's all like, let's do our best today for <laughs> my friends. Right. You know, it's, it's just different. Oh, what happened to your other arms, bro? They were awesome. Think how much you could eat with all those arms. No one can kill Velitra. It's apparently the name for Earth's Vag. Velitra. Okay. You know, maybe you just call it a loss, because something like that just kind of fucks up the Earth forever. Just let it go. What? What? Okay. Right. C-3PO, sure. Yeah. Yep, and min -Mei. Yeah, whatever. It's like Twiggy from Buck Rogers. <laughs> Purify the surviving Goma. The power of my eight guardian generals is invincible. May Shinkoku prosper in everlasting glory. I'm just going to start saying <laughs> that to strangers. Yeah, I just want you to go out on the street and start talking about purifying the... You're finding the whatevers to him. I'll give it 30 minutes before Homeland Security shows up and puts me <laughs> into a black van. Why couldn't they build the rest of the dude? Like, come yeah, on. Yeah, like Sinistar. Yeah. Hey, all game. right, we just beat the <laughs> game. All right. That's awesome. Uh, all so, right, Asher's done. Wrath 2 coming next year. Yeah. <laughs> Make sure to tune in for our review later this week. Part 1, Suffering. Episode 1, The Coming of a New Dawn. Time score. I got an S rank. I got an A rank. I got an A rank. That's good, right? Yeah. S is obviously better than A. Okay. Obviously, but... <clears throat> I got the Anger Management Trophy. Sure. Let's see. And we got about 10 minutes left, so let's see if we can get down Jesus. to some... Uh, get down to the ground. 
<laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I kinda hate this. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. What is it exactly that you hate about it? It doesn't make any sense. There's mm -hmm. just a bunch of random things. It doesn't really feel like a game. It just feels like I'm pushing a bunch of buttons to make crazy shit I don't understand happen on the screen. Uh, it's more like a fucking Japanese art installation. Okay. And it's a bad for even greater vile beast. We're just gonna go ahead and uh Good call. Let's go right over there. Wait, when did all this happen? I don't... No, come on, game. El Shaddai did this as well. Like, when did all this happen? Shouldn't we have played this level of the game? Maybe we skipped it in that little cutscene thing. Hit and select just skips the entire episode? I don't know. Maybe. <laughs> wow, it sure is. I think give you points for, uh, for creativity on that Do one. Do not look to me for answers about this. So if it goes back to another, like, painted... Oh, okay. So... so hey, what did, I, what did I say? Don't yeah. ask me. Okay. I don't fucking know. All right, know. all right. Wait, I thought all these guys got blown up. Hey, look, Naboo won. Yeah. <laughs> Let's give the Gungans the, the giant glowing sphere. Do you take... You guys need to get those cups off your head. It's super bomb bad. <laughs> oh, wait, so now we're going to level up? Talk to people? This guy's got a house. <laughs> this is the sort of dude that lives in like the Rageatorium or something. <laughs> right? Oh, he's married with a really skanky looking <laughs> daughter. Okay. Yeah, that's way too much eye makeup. How many Sura. times have I told you, Ashura Jr.? Some giant space fish is going to come along and say some <laughs> sweet words to her. Uh, what's with the edges on these guys? It's really distracting me. Like when they're on the edge of their hair, it gets all weird and shit whenever yeah. they move. They look like they're claymation almost. Yeah. Oh. Cage Bosch. Cagey Boosh. Kage Boosh. Okay. So, all that punch in the earth and the vagina had no <laughs> no effect whatsoever on this idyllic land in which they yeah. live. Yeah, I mean, maybe, maybe they're on a different planet. Okay. Yeah, they did have spaceships, so. I'm just, I'm, I'm like, sure as wrath, can you just, can you stick to either sci-fi or fantasy? But you're really messing me up with both of these. All right, dude, now give me the, give me a, give me you, a mission. Give me a mission to go punch some other stuff. got a hat like a wine stopper. <laughs> My liege. Uh-oh. No, Grandpa! Okay. Random dead guy. And shit's You're... invading, and I've got a like John Woo, right? Okay. Yes. Oh. Where was all that blood when I was walking up to him? And now you're about to get framed for murder. There you go. Just like Max Payne. Well, maybe not quite. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so now we've got a... Wow, they, these guys jump to conclusions just in a second, don't they? Well, look at them. <laughs> but didn't he just save the world? No, wait, I want to fight these guys, dude. Don't run. I want to do something. Um, maybe stop and try to figure it out. Ooh. The exposition train just ain't a stopping on this no. one. <laughs> hate this. Well, look on the bright side. When you play this for review, you can just skip over all these scenes and go Great. right to ass beating. All right, this looks like I get to fight guys. Nope. So this is that reimagining of the fugitive that Japan has been saying they're going to make for a while. Yeah. Was <laughs> a one-armed man. I didn't kill my wife. Oh, I don't care. Hey, all right. Continuous attack. Okay. Heavy attack. Okay. Combo attack. 
Okay. These other buttons must do something. Okay, that's jump. So it is pretty much God of War. Well, sort of. It doesn't seem quite as elegant and precise as God of War. Well, they're teaching. This is, you know, stage yeah. one where yeah, they're teaching you stuff. So now they're going to teach me how to do the... Break a bunch of dudes off of your back move. And fade away to a memory when we had a picnic with our daughter and wife. No, come on. I know, seriously. Come on, game. No, we saw this. Like, I keep expecting there to be commercials between those two screens. Yeah. <laughs> Meanwhile, on Asura's Wrath. Oh, and this Captain Fabulous. And he's coming to... He's a bad guy? your wife. All right. I mean, just look at the way he was acting earlier. Yeah, he's a bad guy. Yeah. He's not quite as bad, though, as that guy in Dynasty Warriors. <laughs> oh, that was just... Oh. Dude, you got some shit sticking out of your back. You might want to, you know, just real quick, right behind you. Just shake it off. Get some spears in you. Oh. Nope. Okay, Ooh. where's the dodge button? <laughs> yes. <laughs> See you later, fat man. Wait, where the uh, hell jump? did he? Oh. Okay. So jump and... Bam! <laughs> <laughs> oh, so dramatic. <laughs> there needed to be speed lines in the background. <laughs> Is that his... Those wife and daughter? Wife and daughter, yeah. Oh, so he's just taking off? He's like, good luck, I'm out. No, he's got to go check on them to make sure they're safe, because uh, apparently fat guy threatened him or something. So he is Kratos. Yes. So, well, no. No, Kratos killed his family. That was much more epic. I can spoil God of War, right? Sure. <laughs> I mean, it's been three games by now. Yeah. So. Okay, so... Dude, seriously, doesn't that hurt even a little bit? <laughs> yeah. I think that's all the action we're going to get. We've got three minutes left. Okay. We're going to get something. <laughs> Fine. There's, we've been at this for almost half an hour. Yeah. Very little substantive gameplay. Yeah. And you know that's one of my pet peeves. It annoys the shit out of me. Of course, you know what? Like, as soon as we got done recording Final Fantasy XIII, mm -hmm. the game world opened up and you played for the next, like, 40 hours after that. Oh, so. yeah. No, it was good when you weren't here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, is he going to make the Earth, like, rotate backwards like <laughs> Superman? I've never actually had She's cause. She's Bakta chamber. Never actually had cause in my life to... <coughs> throw my head back and scream to the heavens in distress. <laughs> so wait, these guys are all bad? It's like all of his god family is messing with him. Yeah. Or at least those jackasses. Uh, okay. Oh. Hello, Soul Calibur. How are you? <laughs> yeah. Until Voldo shows up. Actually, if this guy was married to, like, Ivy, it would not make it. <laughs> right. Like, yeah, okay, that makes perfect sense. Okay. He got shocked by something. By that guy. It's Odin? Wait, who, what religion are we are we ripping off this time? I don't know. I can't identify it right well, now. Well, there are some Sumerian references. Okay. Um, that's all I got so far. <laughs> I mean, Mithra, okay. or I think, is Sumerian, if I'm not mistaken. I, dude, I'm not Sumerian, so I don't know. <laughs> well, you don't got to be racist <laughs> about it against all of our Sumerian listeners. Okay, bad guy, bad guy. These two in the back maybe, maybe okay. Kill them all. <laughs> Burden of your wrath in your life. Okay. What's he going to do? Is he being thrown out of heaven? And why? Uh, because I think he killed the 
the hat guy. But <sighs> I, dude, I don't, I don't know. Yeah. Whatever Jump it is, it's not conclusions. cool. Conclusions. <laughs> Killing the hat guy. They don't even want to have an exhaustive investigation. Yeah. So kill your wife, take your daughter, get the fuck out. Oh no, dude. Watch out. Five bucks as he goes over that edge. That's fine. <laughs> I don't care. Grow your other arms, dude, and start whipping some ass. He looks like a bird. He does. Okay. Do it. Kill me now. What's wrong with the moon? I'm uh. so bored. <laughs> <laughs> now this guy's still holding us. So I saw you. I saw your uh, scotch and gummy bears on Lounge Geeks the other day. Yeah. Does that actually taste good? That's okay. Yeah. Just like sugary, like putting a sugar cube in there. Pretty much, yeah. And you still get that weird tanginess that some of the gummy bears have. I guess the question is, after you get done, do you have a bunch of uh, scotch-soaked gummy bears yes. that you can then eat? <laughs> yes, you do. <laughs> and they burn like delicious scotch. Nice. Why do they she want her? She just said, talk to the hand. <laughs> she did. <laughs> <laughs> and turned her into a pillar of salt or mood ring. Turned her into a pillar of mood ring. Okay, on that note, yeah. we're going to take a break. Um, we have 30 more minutes of this shit. Yeah, join us back again, and we will see if this becomes any more intelligible. I don't know, man. Yeah? Jesus. <laughs> Why do you put me through this? Well, I'm a simple guy. I'm hoping that somewhere in this insanity you will find enlightenment. Well, you couldn't bring over, like, a bag of weed or something? <laughs>